son of Poseidon. I used to date your daddy. Ten mythical creatures that could actually exist. Just because you haven't seen something doesn't mean it doesn't exist, does it? Stories of fantastic and mythological creatures like the Boogeyman and Mermaids have circled humanity for thousands of years. With repeated sightings and overlapping tales, you have to wonder, is there some truth to the stories of such mysterious creatures? We're about to find out. Welcome to another episode of Fictionary. Today, we're counting down 10 mythical creatures that could actually exist. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that notification so you don't miss out on any more fact-revealing videos like this one. Alright, let's uncover some of these unusual creatures, shall we? Number 10. Montauk Monster Back in July 2008, a highly mysterious and pretty scary looking creature washed up on Montauk Beach in the US. Having been sighted for the first time ever, the vicious being was quickly nicknamed the Montauk Monster. Though many believed it was a hoax, a pretty accurate photo of a near hairless, four-legged, clawed creature caught the attention of the World Wide Web for months after its sighting. Others suspected it was the body of a genetically modified animal. Whatever the case may be, the dead body of this mythical looking creature vanished just as mysteriously as it had appeared, which makes you wonder, was it fact or fiction? Number 9. Loch Ness Monster First reported in 1993, the Loch Ness Monster is believed to be an aquatic beast resembling a plesiosaur that inhabits Scotland's Loch Ness. Since its first sighting, several locals and tourists claim to have seen figures resembling the beast in the deep and cold waters of the lake. The countless reports and even a few authentic photos have led to scientific investigations using everything from sonar beams to submarines. But hard evidence of the Loch Ness myth has yet to surface. So far, no evidence proving or dispelling the myth has been found. So good old Nessie may just as well still be out there somewhere. Number 8. Dire Wolves It's a freak. It's a dire wolf. In Game of Thrones and video games like Dungeons and Dragons, dire wolves are portrayed as gigantic wolves easily capable of taking down a grown man, as they often do. Believe it or not, large dire-like wolves actually walked the earth about 10,000 years ago, towards the end of our last major ice age. These vicious howlers were not only the largest ancestral canines that ever lived, they also had the strongest bite force ever believed possible on a dog. Their sheer size made it possible for them to take down horses, camels, bison, and of course, human beings during the ice age. Now let's see a modern chihuahua do that. It's likely their ferocious nature gave way to folklore about their mythological abilities, and while those were definitely pulled out of contest, the existence of these large mythical canines was not. Number 7. Emuki It's unlikely real dragons ever existed. However, there may be some skewed evidence pointing towards the existence of a long-bodied Korean dragon known as the Emuki. These dragons are often seen in paintings or as statues and are depicted as long-bodied, snake-like reptiles with four legs. Unlike your typical European dragons, Amugi have no wings and are actually considered benevolent creatures related to water and agriculture. While no fossil of such a creature has ever been found, it may have been a Titanoboa that gave way to rumors of this dragon's existence. Titanoboa was the largest snake to ever slither across the ground and various specimens have been found indicating they could grow up to 42 feet long and weigh as much as an adult elephant. Number 6. Chupacabra First sighted in Puerto Rico in the 90s, this legendary goat-sucking dog is said to drain the blood of livestock. Unlike most monsters, however, this creature is not based exclusively on sightings as chupacabra bodies have reportedly been found. However, DNA tests revealed a pretty mundane reality. The bodies have invariably turned out to be coyotes, dogs, or raccoons, barring one that was actually a fish. Do they exist? Technically, yes. Are they that mythical after all? Perhaps not. Number 5. Yeti 
From the Himalayan mountains come stories of a larger, abominable snowman known as the Yeti. So much for all the stories of the furry, white, ape-like creature that supposedly walks on two feet, though. Analysis of nine DNA samples believed to be derived from the so-called Yeti lead back to various species of bears native to the area. There you have it, ladies and gents. The Yeti seems to live only in fictional books and movies. But in real life, he exists as a not-so-mythical fluffy creature we call a bear. Number 4. Mermaids We all believe mermaids to be the enchanting mating creatures with the glimmering lower body of a fish that seduces sailors from miles away and leads ships into wreckage. While no evidence of mermaids as we know them today has ever been found, the Fiji mermaid was quite an exception. A showman named P.T. Barnum introduced a not-so-beautiful upper body of a small monkey sewn together with the lower body of a fish to cash in on the public's curiosity. So if anywhere, mermaids only existed as half-hairy monkeys on Barnum's stage. Still something, isn't it? Number 3. Blemier. What's a Blemier, you asked? Sailors once brought back tales of so-called headless wild men from Asia and Africa, which later came to be known as the Blemier. They were said to be covered in hair and didn't have heads, which left their facial features on their chest. Europeans were fascinated by these tales, and even Shakespeare made mention of these legendary wild men in Othello. Whether they truly existed as the far-fetched forms they were described as, we'll never know. However, they may have been the result of poorly told stories of gorillas, which hadn't been described in scientific journals until the mid-1800s. That or the tales could be the result of African tribesmen, who would lower their heads as they walked. So perhaps the mythical Blemier did in fact exist, we just didn't know it wasn't a Blemier. Number 2. Ogopogo. If you're familiar with the Pokemon Gyarados, the legendary Ogopogo will make sense to you right away. This mythical creature was apparently spotted in Okanagan Lake in British Columbia, Canada back in the 19th century, and several sightings have been reported thereafter. There is no conclusive evidence, however, the Ogopogo is often described as a dark, multi-hump creature with green, black, brown, or gray skin. The head has been said to resemble that of a snake, sheep, horse, seal, or even an alligator. Eyewitnesses can't seem to agree on one description. Either way, it seems Canada found themselves their very own Loch Ness Monster, eh? If you thought old Nessie was well documented, there is an even better chance the Ogopogo is lurking around somewhere as there is a lot more video and photography pointing towards the existence of this lake creature. Number 1. Kraken Release the Kraken! Atop our list is a creature that definitely does exist, albeit not nearly as large as it's thought to be. Often described as a gigantic, ferocious octopus lurking in dark waters that pulls down entire ships of sailors with its massive tentacles, the Kraken is a true mythological monster. And while the Kraken may have been described as an aggressive killer of semen, it is more likely confused with a colossal squid. Believe it or not, these squid can reach lengths of up to 33 feet and weigh in at over 1,500 pounds. And although not as gigantic as the legendary Kraken, they do have strong tentacles and even feature hooked claws. These animals have been sighted for thousands of years, but the first live colossal squid wasn't captured until 2007. So it's likely the Kraken did in fact exist, albeit as a highly exaggerated version of these not-so-small squid. And those were 10 mythical creatures that could actually exist. Do you agree with our theories? Let us know in the comments below!